All right, we're visiting with Scott Wentz here at Newell High School. Scott's the assistant golf coach and also the girls high school basketball coach. And uh, Scott, uh, kind of a transition time of year, got uh, 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 basketball starting up. When does that start? We can first start practicing the uh, 2nd of December. Mm -hmm. um, so we're just having some kids come in and do some individual workouts in the mornings and uh, trying to get them back in and moving a little bit. Some of them had some breaks between cross country and volleyball being over. And the boys with football over, we got to kind of keep them a little active. So mm -hmm. we're coming in in the mornings and shooting around, playing a little basketball. Try to keep them going before uh, we hit the road. How long have you been here at Newell High School? You know, I started here as a student teacher in 1993. And then in 99, I changed, went to Whitewood for about four years. Spent uh, a year in Iraq after that. And then I came back here um, in 2005. So 2005, 2019. So about 15 plus another four, almost 20 years. So you've seen a lot of great athletes uh, come and go here at Newell High School. We saw a lot of athletes come through here. Um, I was at, I was here in 93 with the Stapp girls were here at that time and watched mm -hmm. them go through college. And then in, the, you know, in 2000, you know, that 9, 10, 11, we've had really good uh, basketball programs. Mm -hmm. And we've seen a lot of kids go out and be successful, not necessarily in sports, but that's kind of got them headed in that direction. And then they've used hopefully some of those life lessons that they've learned um, into their future careers. How the girls do last year and what do you expect this year? You know we were I believe 10 and 10 last year. We were young last year had one senior and six sophomores so this year we can't say we're young anymore. This will be the year that we're going to have to figure out who we are. We should be competitive. I think our region is going to be a very good region of course being Faith being one of the top teams. Uh, they'll be the, the mark but I think there's probably four or five teams that are compete for those two two spots in the Sodak 16. So hopefully we can be one of those teams. It'll, it'll be a tough year, and we'll see what happens. We're going to want to run and jump and press and and have a little bit of controlled chaos. It'll be the best for us. Yeah. And when does golf get going? You know, golf gets going in uh, after the state basketball term. So it'll be right around mid March is when we start. And, and hopefully this year there's uh, not snow on the ground. You know, we usually spend a week or two in the gym practice in our swings which you don't get a lot accomplished because of the snow or the cold wind or something so mid-march we should be going and getting outside and what's your background did you play high school sports and i'm originally from uh dupree who grew up on a, a large ranch south of dupree where i did football basketball and track there and then i went and played college football at uh, black hills state university mm -hmm. which is called was called black hills college when i was there uh, retired from the south dakota national guard and uh that's about it yeah. All right, sounds good. Well, Scott, we appreciate you joining us here on Black Hills TV. All right, thank you very much. Yeah.